here, starting on the inside as Double Vision moves in alongside Rooster and Cara, the escapee. Second line of Cougar Icon with Ground Giveaway and Coffee Road. There's the green light. The Lua's on the move. This is race number nine. The Swallow Drive meets five wins plus non-penalty set and away. Double Vision began. Well, Grand Giveaway showing toe and goes to the lead. Third posse Coffee Road from Carrick the Escapee. Rooster and back in the tail is Cougar Icon. Down the back. Grand Giveaway leads by a length. Coffee Road out after it. Then came Double Vision to break back the Rooster with uh, Cougar Icon and Carrick the Escapee. They go three wide on the turn and the leader's Double Vision is shot clear and Double Vision defeats here, Coffee Road. Third spot goes to Grand Giveaway from Rooster. Four next in there in the latter stages by Cara the Escapee and Cougar Icon before it. 23.40 on the race time. Ha! Oh, double vision. I like this Greyhound. What it did there because, as I said, they went three wide on the turn. You had Grand Giveaway alongside Coffee Road and Double Vision. And Coffee Road was probably the one that you're expecting to probably show its toe late in the race. But all of a sudden, Double Vision said, I'll find the inside run. And that's what it did for David Peckham. So Double Vision first. As I said, trainer David Peckham, owned by the Nine of a Syndicate. And it is a black dog from Fernando Bale out of Midnight Elsa. Second spot going to the eight pink in Coffee Road. Robert Warmbell, or Warmwell, is the trainer and owner. A red fawn dog from Barsha Bale out of Rose of Tuscany. And third spot going to Grand Giveaway, the four blue. Sean Bluch, the owner and trainer. Black girl from El Gran Senor out of Bel Air Mist. The time of 23.40, 1, 8, 4, 5. The numbers after the running of race number nine. Double vision, too good. And as we await now for the margins and sections to come up, with the margin reading three and a quarter by half a length, three and a quarter by half a length, and just waiting for that section to come up. But 23.40 was the race time, and the all clear comes through.